look at my brothers and their relationship with my mum. It's very different to the one that I have. Yeah, it's very different to the one. I mean, I'll be honest with you. I think I'm quite jealous of it. I'm quite envious of their relationship, you know, because it's, uh, it's much more relaxed. You know, I, I'll give you an example. My brother went to take my mum out for lunch recently in Brighton. He was like, just taking mum out, Jen. Yeah, God, we just love spending time together. We just love, everything's just really chilled out and relaxed. <laughs> and it's just really free flow. We just have a really free flow time with mum. Because we just love spending time together. Because just, we're just a really cool free flow. Just mum and I just really get on. I don't know what to tell you. We just love spending time together. We're just really free flow. It's just like, I think we're best friends. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Of course, of course, they, they, he has a free flow time with my mum because when they were growing up, my mum left and just let them be, let him be, not me. When I was growing up, she was there. She was always just there. Whatever I was doing, she was sitting just there, just judging every little thing that I do. And now, my mum is living in my house. And so I judge her. Oh, yeah. I judge her. I think I've got, um, I think I've got that thing, uh, ungrateful itis, where I've completely forgotten every good thing that my mother has ever done for me. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm like I'm only doing stand-up comedy because of my mum. I'll be honest with you, I've been doing this for years in the wilderness, where there was absolutely no sign that was ever going to make a success out of it, let alone earn a living. And there were times I phoned up my mum, going, "I can't handle this, mum. I just cannot take this job any longer. It's actually, dr it's draining me. I can't do it." My mum would be like, "No, Jennifer, you keep going. You keep going. You keep doing this stand-up comedy, Jennifer, you know, because I believe in you." You can achieve this, you do this, you go for it, Jennifer. You know why? Because you are funny. You are funny, Jennifer. You wanna know why? It's your face. <laughs> you have a funny face. Sometimes I look at your face and I laugh. <laughs> Stand-up comedy is an incredibly competitive career to be getting involved in, by the way. Incredibly competitive. And, uh, and but, but still pales into insignificance with the, uh, you know, the competition of being a mother. Um, I'll give you an example. I told you how my, uh, my children didn't sleep for nearly three years. Well, God forbid I should say that out loud in front of a room full of mums, because there's always one mum doing it better than you. Oh, yeah, and she can't keep that shit to herself. <laughs> oh, no, she's got to let you know about it. Oh, yeah. Oh, dear, I'm so sorry to hear your children aren't sleeping. Poor you. Noah here. <laughs> he slept through since birth. <laughs> and I think it's something to do with the energy you give your children. I really believe that. I really believe if you give your children positive energy, they really feed off that energy and they internalize that energy and then they take that energy. <laughs> you know, this is the kind of woman that has a piece of a daughter's placenta around her neck. Yeah? <laughs> she makes her own almond milk. Yeah. And I say, oh, jog on, love! Do you want to know why your kid is sleeping? I'll tell you why. It's because you bored him to death <laughs> with your tedious, cursed, you all stop worshipping bullshit. We didn't buy a cot. Um, we just made one from buttons. <laughs> Thank you for watching Solar Theatre on YouTube. Subscribe now for more S-Comedy.